everyone, Vian and Kristen here from Mountain Road. Uh, today we've got a special video for you, a product that's very dear to my heart, being a South African um, and living here in the US, being able to get this product here makes my heart very, very happy. And that is Biltong. All right, so if you haven't heard of Biltong before, for those Americans watching, um, it's basically like beef jerky, but... It's not Biltong. No, it's not Biltong, <laughs> it's Biltong. Bil <laughs> um, so kind of like beef jerky, but also not beef jerky. Um, and I'll let Kristen explain more about the differences and maybe what makes this one special. But before I get to that, let me explain to you some of the South African culture and what goes around actually how you should go about enjoying it, right? As you can see here, we're busy cooking out in the US, you'll call it a barbecue. We in South Africa call this a braai. So if you're having a braai outdoors, and also this is a big difference between the US and South Africa, we like to do coal lit fires um, for braai. No propane. No propane. You uh, can get it there, but yeah, yeah it's much preferred. We do it the real way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so biltong is normally served while you enjoy your braai um, as a nice snack. Um, we also have tradition of watching rugby as opposed to football. And again, that would be a big snack during um, the watching of a, of a rugby game. And then for me as an athlete, um, triathlete and, and cyclist, um, I found this to be a super helpful product. You know, afterwards as a nice protein snack or even on the bike, um, you can take it along. It's dry, it won't melt or or um, you know it's not very heavy to take with you in your back cycling pocket so very awesome product I love it and I'm sure you'll love it as well the way we've been getting it here in this in the US is through a very cool company called Ayobayo um, now Kristen will hold up the packaging there <laughs> um, we first came to know of this through their online website um, Kristen did some awesome searching and uh, found this product and that made my heart very very happy um <laughs> also and we recently discovered this that the whole foods in our area does stock this and um, so we we expect that to be probably a nationwide thing here in the u.s it says proudly made in the u.s but based on the south african recipe um, and i can really attest to that as a south african they did this pretty well uh, and i would actually argue that maybe even better than the South African biltong. Mm -hmm. you know, I might get some people a little bit angry, but when I was living in South Africa, I couldn't really enjoy the biltong because it normally has a lot of extra, you know, MSG in it and um, some of the spices just uh, would be the sort of thing that I would have a, an allergic reaction to. So um, here they keep the ingredients really simple. Um, the, with the biltong, it's just beef, sea salt, coriander, Worcestershire powder, pepper, and vinegar. And then this is the druvorsch. Druvorsch, yes. <laughs> so that translates to dried sausage. I'm holding a piece in my hand right here. You can see it. it's kind of like a, a hardened piece of sausage um, and basically made the same way as biltong where they dry out the actual pieces of meat. This one, they season the sausage, hang it up, and also dries out to form this air dried sticks. Yeah. And um, I've got a, an allergy to nightshades, so I can't have tomatoes or peppers. Um, and with the drawer uh, it actually doesn't have any of the, the tomato or peppers in it. It does have um, black pepper in it, uh, but technically that's not a nightshade, so it works. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's a really great product to take along if you're hiking or um, traveling, anywhere where you're going to be on the road. Um, yeah. yeah, very cool product truly south african and we figured we would get into the spirit of the 24th of september so south africans watching you will know that that's national Day. um <laughs> officially named heritage day in south africa it's a public holiday but um it's kind of like memorial day in the u.s exactly it's the beginning of summer exactly for south yeah um and so they kick it off normally with outdoor sunshine and an outdoor braai um, and so we figured we'll get into the into that spirit as well seeing that it's pretty close to the 24th of September um, and we're doing it in a truly South African way 
with the Biltong and Drivors right here as well. <laughs> Alright, so we hope you enjoyed this video. Awesome product. Check it out. A yo by yo. You can buy it online on their website if you're um, not local to the Virginia area, but I think they will start actually having it out in other stores as well. And you can check your Whole Foods to see if it's available. Yeah, definitely very cool. Um, as my seal of approval, <laughs> as a <it's> seller. <laughs>